पगडंडी the path the creator there are certain experiences which every time somebody you meet the client i always felt that you have to learn you have to keep on learning so uh, mr kuraki wala is the chairman and md of bopar and uh he gave me an example uh, he was doing his residence and he was giving us lots and lots of instructions and kind of things so at the end of the instruction he said that uh, uh kuzima do you remember everything because i, I was also young i had not penned down a single thing so then he told me that kuzima there is one thing which is very important in life you know You know, when you go to an Iranian restaurant, the waiter over there he says, "Table number two, pe ek pani kam chai do." When you go to the five-star hotel and you order a tea, he will ask you several questions. He will create it will be a process which he takes it over there, and he will write down, pen down everything and put it in the process. something which i understood from him so well that designing is not the only thing but there is a process which is required in it and that process is very very important for us hello everybody uh, i am architect khuzema chitalwala from designers group mumbai which specializes into hospitality with 30 years 30 plus years of experience uh, i want to thank india art and design.com for uh, giving me an opportunity this opportunity to share my journey uh, with my fraternity my colleagues uh, i hope if somebody finds it inspirational or somebody finds it worthwhile first and foremost i never intended to become an architect i was i wanted to become a doctor because my brother was a doctor and <laughs> <laughs> because in general there are only two options in my time that is were available with a doctor or a engineer but then uh, i think so uh, by all the means and by destiny i became an architect i joined architecture and i became an architect we started our practice in madhi designers group was established we were doing all kind of projects doing architecture interior commercial residential whatever we got so we did some did all the upgrades from 94 to 97 and uh, then came a, a turning point where we got uh, all from titan and they wanted to us to be the the, the architects for west west zone which includes gujarat maharashtra uh, madhya pradesh and goa and We did huge number of Titan stores. Within a decade's time, we we had a good, good more than 150-200 odd stores in Chitra. When we are working with Vokard, we also work with uh, his vice president project, Mr. Sampat Kumar, who is, I would say, he is my guru. And in terms of hospitality, because he was an ex-hospitality guy, but working with Vokard, so one fine day when he Uh, after having moved around several places he joined that finally one day in 1999 i got a call and he said that zema i have come to taj and it's time to fulfill your dream so that was something which touched me very very much and we started we had a great deal i worked as a local consultant with taj on international designs initially so that that by 2000 2001 we were that sure that we want to do hospitality and nothing else so we did that and then i think so within the span of uh, probably 5 4 3 four years we must have done i think less than 16 17 projects with that uh after the taj it happened we all of a sudden we realized that we we were in dry and then uh, and the destiny always plays the best role so uh we got a call from pune one of our friends architect friend who was there one of his friend was putting up a hotel 
So I had a very great uh, opportunity to work with uh, Christopher Benninger. So he was the architect of that particular project, and then we did it in years. We did that that property yet exists, and uh, I think so. Uh, that was the first break post Taj. Then we got Faryal, we got Royal Opera, we got started getting all of them in, in queue because he we felt that and it was a hard decision. We had decided we we would we don't want to take anything else. But we would like to establish ourselves. So we had some little rough days on that time. But we we were fortunate enough we could sail out of uh, those rough time and uh, rough weather and uh, uh, get some uh, good projects which we could establish. And fortunately for us, uh, we had decent portfolio. People understood by that time that we understand hospitality. So we started working with a lot of Indian brands initially. We were working for. Another five to seven years, we were always working with uh, domestic brand. I think so. I would say not even five seven, but for even for ten years, we worked with domestic brands only. Then on, it is last one decade that we are, I have been able to break the ice and uh, do some nice work. You see, in earlier stage, we never used to realize the importance of. Uh, how important the local nuances are. How important is the concept? How important is the storyline? Today, we, whether it may be a small project or larger project, three star or five star, there is a storyline. There is a concept which binds the company together. And I think so. This is something which which we have learned, it, although late in the day, but we learned and we felt that yes, this is what it is all about. So, for example, if you take over Pilibi, Pilibi has got a very, very strong philosophical uh, concept, and that concept is about Purusharth. So, the building itself was in four four quarters, four 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 spaces. So, from uh, Dharma, Artha, Karma, and Moksha. Haridwar is also the gateway to the Charadham Yatra of Shiva. Shiva. So how Shiva has been influenced? There is a Nandi which is kept kept over there, but Nandi is generally find it in black color. This was in Nilkanth color which we created. So representation of Shiva. Then we had Rudraksh used in the backdrop part which is there again with the double. So those those are also um, uh, depiction of Shiva and very contemporary. So the the those kind of storyline that Purushartha with to the moksha. Is something which is which is a great concept, which is a great storyline. I said, you know, for us, uh, we we get more excited with uh, design challenges which we face in in hospitality because there is there is nothing which I can repeat, <laughs> and there has been instances where I have uh, done probably two three hotels in a radius of a couple of kilometers. So, and each hotel speaks a different, different language, different story, which is, which is, which I find it more exciting than anything else. So, you're working with Epar, you're working with uh, Taj, you are working with ITC, you are working with you, Mary, you, Hilton. Everybody is there with us. And so, if you, I, I feel that uh, if you could, if you could take a simple approach to everything, uh, your designs are very clean. Very uh, uncluttered. Uh, there is more relativity. You can more. I think so. The shelf life of the design is much more higher than uh, if you if you just keep on adding elements to it.